Are you looking for peace of mind at your doorstep? Look no further. With the Blink Video Doorbell, your home's entrance is always within your control. Check out the link in the video description to learn more and get your Blink Video Doorbell on Amazon. Your home is in your hands. A lip reader has revealed the Princess of Wales' heartwarming reaction to a standing ovation during the Wimbledon final. As Charlotte, 9, and her mother, the Princess of Wales, 42, arrived to take their seats at the royal box on the center court, the pair were met with a standing ovation and applause. The mother and daughter and Kate's sister, Pippa Middleton, saw the reigning champion, Carlos Alcaraz take on veteran Novak Djokovic, winning in three sets. Lip reader Jeremy Freeman analyzed the moment Kate Middleton and Princess Charlotte arrived at the court. Speaking to the son, the expert claims the mother of three asked her daughter to come over here as they approached their seats in the prestigious royal box. According to the expert, Princess Charlotte looked slightly confused as they got to their designated seats, with Kate guiding her along, with Pippa shortly behind. The future queen, who has stepped away from public royal duties while undergoing cancer treatment, then said thank you to the woman who escorted them and then waved to the crowd, who were standing up and clapping for both princesses. The Princess of Wales said hi to spectators and then turned to Deborah Javants and said, so sweet. Kate presented the Wimbledon trophy to Carlos Alcaraz this afternoon as the Spaniard won the Grand Slam for the second year in a row. Kate and Charlotte spoke to the tennis player Alcaraz off the court and revealed she had been watching his performance at home. Kate said, this is Charlotte, she was, cheering you on. You had everything crossed. Alcaraz, who was dressed in all white and holding his trophy, replied, nice to meet you. Kate then said, we've watched a lot on telly, so it's great to finally get to meet you, before repeating herself as the athlete was struggling to hear her. A starstruck Charlotte looked slightly shy as she stood next to Kate and smiled at Alcaraz during their conversation, as her Aunt Pippa stood behind the pair and grinned at the interaction. Before passing the trophy to Alcaraz earlier on, Kate commiserated and shook the hand of runner-up Novak Djokovic. Dressed in a 1,295 pounds bespoke dress from Sofia, the royal was greeted with a standing ovation as she headed into the royal box at Wimbledon earlier in the day. Before the mother-daughter duo took their seats in the royal box, they met with female tennis stars, including 21-year-old Emma Raducanu, who all presented Kate with a bouquet of flowers. Charlotte grinned from ear to ear as she met with the tennis star who sadly saw her Wimbledon dream crushed on center court by New Zealand qualifier Lulu Sun last week. Kate and Charlotte were also greeted by Sony Cardle, Lily Miyazaki, Lucy Shecker, and Flora Johnson as they arrived on the players' lawn at Wimbledon before entering center court. Charlotte gave wheelchair tennis player Shecker a pinky promise that she would try the sport alongside her mother. Kate was also introduced to Raducanu, who was knocked out in the fourth round of this year's championships, telling her, it was so hard to see you go out. U.S. Open winner Raducanu said it was amazing to have the support of the princess and to see her here looking so healthy and happy. The daughter of the prince and princess of Wales, who sported a 70-pound polka dot dress from Guess, was thrilled to meet the tennis star and was photographed smiling ear to ear in her presence. The mother and daughter then met the work at Wimbledon program which supports young people from a range of backgrounds with roles at the championships. Alcaraz now has four Grand Slam trophies with a perfect record in major finals, after his two Wimbledon triumphs, his U.S. Open victory in 2022 and his French Open win last month. Defeat denied Djokovic a 25th Grand Slam title to surpass Margaret Court in the all-time list and also equal Roger Federer's Hall of Eight Men's Singles titles at Wimbledon. They were without Prince George, 10, perhaps indicating he will join his father at the Euros final in Berlin this evening. While meeting the players, Kate said Charlotte, who was wearing a navy polka dot dress, had been practicing yesterday and that tennis was really great for the youngsters. Kate said she had been filling in the leaderboard with Charlotte during Wimbledon, adding, as a family, we play a lot. After being asked to try wheelchair tennis by Shu, 